they're off for the Racing Post Trophy and Birdman just missed half a beat uh, from the stalls, was last to come out, away to the left and closest to the rail, King's Barnes was away smartly with Trading Leather in the centre and Steeler on the right. The grey Sir Patrick Moore, one of the rank outsiders, attracts them with first cornerstone, the white-faced colt in the slipstream of Steeler on the right of the cluster. At Van der Neer, Richard Hughes, striped cap, last but one, and Birdman races at the tail, and they go through the first quarter mile with trading leather under Kevin Manning, disputing it with Steeler, Kieran Fallon, the green jacket. A length and a half then to King's Barnes on the near side of first cornerstone, and then Van der Neer in a line of three for last place with Birdman on the left, and the grey Sir Patrick Moore between them. Down past halfway in the Racing Post Trophy. Looks a generously run affair. Steeler is winding it up and Trading Leather is chivied along by Manning. Back in the field, Hughes crouching a little lower now and Van Denier. Kings Barnes, Joseph O'Brien, the dark blue, stalking the leaders with first cornerstone on the far side. Down to the last two and a half furlong. Still Steeler from Trading Leather, first cornerstone. Here goes Kings Barnes beginning to ease into it, followed through by Van Denier. Passing the two, Steeler a tough horse, hard to pass, but Kings Barnes breezes up on the near side to deliver his challenge. First cornerstone, the far side. Trading leather back and forth, down to the last furlong. Kings Barnes quickens impressively, stretches a couple of lengths clear from Steeler. First cornerstone, Vandenier is running on well down the near side. Kings Barnes got first run onto Joseph O'Brien and is seeing this out very stoutly. Kings Barnes simply barnstorming. Kings Barnes wins the Racing Post trophy, a magnificent seven in the race for Aidan O'Brien. Brian, close second, Vandenier and Steeler. A first cornerstone was next. Birdman was last.